All right, this video shows the, the building of uh, a masonite uh, template that matches the foam templates that I came up with for my engine cradle. I basically cut a piece of masonite out and wrapped the edges with foil so that I can clamp that to my piece of steel and use my plasma cutter to cut through the steel and just make sure that both pieces get cut correctly. What I've done since uh, last time is I've cut out this uh, uh, board here. It's made of masonite. It's a 3 16th inch masonite. And I cut it out to match, if you can see. A little foam, uh, quarter inch foam piece that was mocking up my rear plate that goes through the rear of the car. As you can see, I've allowed an eighth of an inch on the, the wooden plate. That's for the distance of my uh, plasma torch tip which is about an eighth of an inch off the edge when you drag it along the edge of this template so what this template will do it will be able to let me cut out uh, the plate with my torch and not have to really worry about holding the torch down on the line this plate will give me the ability to cut this uh, steel out in the exact same shape as this you can see that I wrapped the edges with foil, kind of a foil tape, uh, just to try to keep from burning the board. See, here's the foam piece that was that was on the car. The piece that goes through the rear of the car it goes through here. And it's right there, so this will actually bolt to this rail right here, and it'll be a quarter inch thick plate, which will be backed up with another plate coming across the front. I'd like to get the quarter inch plate in first in order to uh, ensure that everything is lined up correctly. I also built this angle gauge, which you set here on the angle. As you can see, this gives me the angle of this bend. So when I take it to the shop, They'll be able, be able to bend that metal, set this down on the metal, and uh, check and make sure that the bend is just the right angle. But I'm going to cut out the steel plates uh, to match that this wooden plate.